name is Kaya for those of you that are new and viewing. Today I'm installing one of Altre's new melted hairline wigs. They were kind of to send over Manuela today and I am trying it in the Amber sun Sunset color. The color that you see on the front is Caramel Mocha but this is what the Amber Sunset looks like. The one that's right in the middle. So we're just going to jump into the installation process and then I'll come back and tell you guys what I think about this wig.
right guys so i am now finished installing this wig so first we'll start off with the rating rating wise i'm gonna give it like an 8.5 out of 10. it's a cute wig but i do feel like it had a little bit of situations here and there that could definitely be corrected so this wig can be bomb so first things first this wig is extremely long which i like okay um this wig is probably hitting let's see if they have it in the stock card because sometimes they do it's not on here anywhere but i would say that this is probably like a good 28 inches long so it is pretty lengthy now i do like the coloring of the wig like i love the black and the brown fade and ombre and blend together the highlight pieces the only thing about it is i feel like and it could just be different on everyone i just feel like when you look at the picture on the stock card it seems like what i thought i was going to be getting i thought that like the highlight pieces we're going to be like right in the front and I think with like how the wig is falling they're not right in the front and and also I need to like flip the hair out in order for you to actually see the color you know like I actually wanted my hair kind of pushed down on the sides here but when I did that I was like I, I don't see my color anymore so um, that was like the biggest thing that stood out to me. The next thing was, while I do, um, while this is a part of the Melted Hairline series, like the lace blends and melts into your skin really good, I feel like I had to do, I had to do a lot of plucking, um, around the front of it because it came pretty full, um, full enough that I would recommend anybody wearing it probably pluck it out because I just think it looks better that way like I didn't even OD pluck mine but you can see that it just looks a whole lot better in general with your um hairline plucked out especially at least the part that's going to be really visible now I do want to say that there was no shedding with this wig of course yes it tangled but I will say that when I was brushing it and I combed it no shedding at all which I really like I also did the adjustable straps in the back you guys so it fits really good now that I did the adjustable straps so without that I would put it in that big head friendly category it has a lot of space in it I'm really interested to see what this caramel mocha color is going to look like I actually ordered that one too so if you guys want to see a YouTube video for that one let me know and I can film that but I just had got that one just to have I didn't have intentions on making a YouTube video but if you guys want to see it let me know and I'm happy to do so. Um, is there anything else about the wig besides lace, color, sizing? The texture of the hair, it's it's not silky, which we love. I love when um, synthetic wigs are not silky. It's more like a semi-yaki feel to it. It's still cute though. Nonetheless, I would still rock this unit for sure. So that's all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate y'all and I will see you guys in my next video. And let me know if you have any questions. Leave them in the comments. I'll see you in the next one. Bye, y'all. All right, y'all. One more time. One more thing. I put it up in this half up, half down do. And I feel like I like it even more with it being styled like this versus down. I think this is really cute. What do you guys think? I think it's cute. I like it like this. It's a love.